headed to the dinosaur den. Let's follow these footprints and check out these creatures that roamed the earth millions of years ago. Yeah! Linda, what's your favorite part of this exhibit here? My favorite part is the fact that visitors can touch so many fossils that were the remains of actual dinosaurs that once roamed to New Jersey. You can touch a, um, a fossilized egg, which is right here. This is so cool. You can actually touch a real dinosaur egg. Wow. Mmm. I don't know about you, but I can make one mean omelet out of this egg. We have actual models of nests. Some eggs were round, some were oval. Trace fossils, the footprints that dinosaurs made. We have a wonderful mural that depicts what New Jersey looked like when dinosaurs roamed this garden state. A fossil is the remain of a dinosaur, a living animal that once lived on the earth. Over time, pressure being applied to the actual bones, they actually uh, transform and become stone-like. They become stone. Mm -hmm. And that takes millions of years? Many millions of years. Many millions of years. Yep. This is so cool. See, dinosaurs came in all sorts of sizes. Some were about the size of humans, raptors down here. But some, like the Argentinosaurus, this dinosaur was as big as a Boeing 747 jet airplane. Just to give you a sense of how big dinosaurs really could get, this giant bone right here, was just the leg bone. And it's taller than me. It's huge! You have an actual model of a Tyrannosaurus Rex skull here at the museum? We do, and it's actually a very famous model. You'll notice that it's a slightly misshapen um, skull, and the reason for that is over many millions of years, as the pressure of the Earth um, was applied, the dinosaur's uh, head got a little misshapen. Huh. The Tyrannosaurus has very razor-sharp teeth, right? That's correct. And what does that tell us about what kind of food it ate millions of years ago? That tells us that that dinosaur was probably a meat-eating dinosaur known as a carnivore. 